Do you think men want women who dress provocatively or modestly? I would say more modest. Um, me personally, I'm not going to sit out there and flaunt everything I have out to the public. Um, so like with this, I'm just like, jeans and t-shirt. You don't need to have your titties out 24-7. So is it fair for a chick to get catcalled if she has her titties out then? Oh, absolutely. I mean, it's like she's asking for it almost. But then again, it's like, be confident in what you're wearing. But also, you know, you have it coming. You know, you can't say like, oh, I'm not sure why you did that. Well, I mean, you're wearing lingerie in the middle of the street. So why do they expect not to be objectified if they're literally objectifying themselves? I don't know. I really, I don't understand the women's brain half the time. I really don't. Yeah. See, here go another one, fellas. Here go another one right here. See, I keep telling y'all, there are some good ones out there. And how she dressed, whether you like what she has on or not, uh, yeah. This is the kind of woman a man would try to marry. Yeah. Oh, uh, I mean, women always say a man gonna do this. Anyway. No, he don't. Y'all only pay attention to these men, and then y'all provoke the men with what y'all doing, how y'all acting, what you're wearing, how you're talking, your body language, all that good stuff. You're provoking a man. Like she said, cat calling. Of course you're going to get cat called by a man if uh, you walking down the street and your body parts are showing. Or I can just see what you're doing. Come on, now. <sighs> hey, I'm trying to tell y'all, ladies. This is what a man wants to marry. Right here. This is what a man will bring home to mom, will try to live he happily ever after with, right here. This is the kind of woman. Uh, this is another woman who is not revealing at all. Who is not showing you what her body looks like at all. More than likely, you could trust this kind of woman. More than likely, this kind of woman would be there for you, have your back, all of that good stuff. This is what we want, ladies. I'm going to say it again. I said it before. I'm going to say it again. Men have women in different categories just like women have men. But the two main categories is one that he'll just fuck, one that he wants to marry and be happy with for the rest of his life. That's it. That's it. Just like women have two main categories, a friend zone, somebody that always be there, listen to them and give them money and validate their feelings and all of that. And a man, they want to, they want them to dominate. They want to dom, a man, they want to dominate her. There we go. <laughs> Couldn't get my words out. There you go. Well, if you want to be married happily ever after, you don't want this single lifestyle and you don't want to be bitter no more and all that crap. Here you go. I mean, who we? I, hey, I don't know how else to put it other than that. These are the kind of women that a man wants to marry. Right here. And she's right. A jean, jeans and a t-shirt. What's wrong with that? And she ain't showing her body or nothing. Look at that. A man is supposed to see what he can have, but imagine what he can get. I see that I can have you. Now I'm trying to figure out and imagine what I can get later on in the relationship. Again, I said this before, I'm going to say it again. Why you think me and my wife been together for so long? Now we've been together for so long, hey, I got to imagine what I can get. I know what I can get. <laughs> It's about y'all ladies showing us that you have self-respect. That's really what it what it boils down to, self-respect. And, and, and if you don't show us you got that self-respect, we don't we go we gone, or we're gonna treat you a certain way. That's just what it is, plain and simple. But at the end of the day, look, ladies, y'all do what y'all want. Y'all not gonna listen. Y'all think y'all know more. So we're saying, okay, 
Okay. You the one that's going to be miserable. You the one that's going to wish. You know what I'm saying? That, that, that stuff like this didn't happen. So, hey, do the things you want. Your life, your business, right? Your body, your choice. Well, my life, my choice. So, think about that.